how overflows what is jati samra this is a technique a psychological technique of exploring the past lives to continue the process of transformation in the present on this this was introduced by mahabir and gautam buddha however its reference is given in bhagavad gita the 43rd sutra of chapter 6 says yatr tant yatr tam buddhi sanyogam labhate parya dehikam yatate cha bhuto bhuya yatate cha tato bhuya sansido kuru nandana yatr tam buddhi sanyogam labhate पौर, पौर देहिकम ततते चयतो भूतः संसिदो कृष्ण कृष्ण टॉक्स अबाउट टेकिंग रिवाइव्स द डिवाइन कॉन्शियसनेस ऑफ हिज पास्ट प्रीवियस लाइफ्स सेज आई हैड मेनी बर्ड्स बिफोर आई नो देम यू नो इट नॉट दोज हु हैव बीन अवेकेंड or the enlightened masters they have made mention at times of their previous lives and also for the process of transformation they made the reference of their connection with a particular seeker in the present life i had mentioned to some of the seekers of our connection because without that it is not possible to establish intimacy of such a standard such level there is aurobindo savitri says there is a power within that knows beyond our knowings we are not aliens nor strangers join we are we are bound to each other by a causeless force sometimes it happens all of a sudden you meet someone and something clicks and deep down there is a feeling that i know this person for a long time so krishna says that he revives the divine consciousness of his previous lives it is something like this in a simple way you are doing some work on a project for some reasons that project was discontinued for a couple of days now when you are going to take it back you will have to revive get into it revive all the understanding and everything before you can proceed because completion of that project is very important for your profession but you had discontinued to certain memories that were certain things that were fresh in your mind has faded now you have to revive revive means you have to recollect what you was doing you have to go through the entire script or the project and see different steps then you will be able to continue that this we know as a musician you are recording a song and then you could not complete it you have to do the next day but for some reason the entire crew was not available so it's a gap of 2 or 3 days now you have to listen to this where you have left and how the the in hindi the word aro and avro is going how the music rises falls and fades 
and then it will take a little while for you to revive all that you have been doing then you will be able to continue same thing happens everyone is endowed with divine consciousness but we do not know our past lives krishna says i know you know it not because of so many things and he again tries to make for that progress in order to achieve complete success now you are working on that project i said it takes sometimes years to create a music it takes sometimes time you are creating a scientific research it takes time you work every day certain hours and then you have to take a rest then you have to discontinue for a certain time or things like that which normally happens so for the success of that you have to revive it once again in your memory what you have been doing where you had gotten the ups, the uh, uh, the blockage so there is there he easily regains touch with the knowledge acquired in the previous body through some coincidence it happens out of psychology has numerous examples when because of coincidence you remember certain thing there was a man ted serio in america he could hear the sound happening far away and this was mentioned in bhagavad gita when the it was certain that the war, war of mahabharat is unavoidable so the blind king expressed his desire to know what is going on on the battlefield then this sage vedavyas offered him that i can give you the divine vision that while you are sitting in the court you can see everything so he says do not give it to me give it to my charioteer sanjay so sanjay was given that divine vision that he is sitting in the court room with the blind king and he is able to see what it is going to what is happening on the battlefield and he gives him the complete narration so in the modern because of it is said that there was an accident in that accident something happened and that serio got this thing he could um, the hear the sounds and see also what it is happening somewhere else so out of all the, uh, the masters can see that they can get the feeling if there is a problem with a particular seeker and master feels it deep within that this particular seeker or a person is in a problem then he works accordingly this is quite natural specifically with mothers mothers feel very um the because their relationship with their children is so intense and deep that sometimes they feel that my son or the daughter is hungry she needs this she is in need of my assistance this is quite natural so krishna tells arjun that nothing goes waste and all your efforts in any practice for meditation will continue in your next birth it is said about one person who used to come to sheik brij mohan lal he was follower of the he was going to one of the fellow disciples of swami vivekanand the latu ji maharaj so he was with him for many years then one day he expressed his desire to be initiated so at this latu said the your share is not with me so he said the how will i meet my master so latu said 
your master will recognize you so it happened it continued he started coming in the company of chacha ji and one day he expressed his desire to be initiated by chacha ji he said no 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 i will not tomorrow my elder son they he used to call him bade mia bade mi elder mia is a uh, is a ma- uh, word for respect or addressing to someone like you say yes gentleman yes ma'am so something like that at times we address our friends or our husband yes ma'am yes gentlemen uh, or the husband address their wives yes madam so at times so when next day he came and he was standing in the corner and waited for his turn when his turn came he paid respect to brij mohan lal and was going to give his introduction so he said no 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 i know you how did he know you because there is an intense inner connection it is like a wifi the messages are connected all you need to know the art of deciphering these so masters each master is like a wifi connection a wave that is there in the existence so he directs his disciples to the other master just as i had mentioned about swami vivekanand and yoganand paramahansa yoganand the vivekanand was to come to parliament of religions on in 1893 september 9th was the parliament of religions so vivekanand was born in 1863 in january and yoganand was born in january of 1893 when yoganand was born vivekanand was wandering around uh, along the length and breadth of india so it happened there was a person in california called nicholson and when he was 5 year old his brother pushed him in a pool 15 feet deep pool and he was gasping for life so all of a sudden he saw a bright light in the sky and a face appeared so it that with that he was protected then one of his brother's friend lowered a particular branch of the tree and he held on and he came then 1893 of september he was visiting chicago and along with his mother he was 17 years of age and outside the conference day hall he saw vivekanand was strolling he told his mother mother she is the man who i saw in the sky and he appeared he saved me from drowning so by the time he said this vivekanand has gone into the cotton the hall and he followed him and he asked him to be initiated vivekanand said no no your share is not with me your master will recognize you and he will shower many blessings on you and also he said he will give you a big silver cup finished him vivekanand the yoganand was born he never met he was born he was 8 or 9 months old and then the story goes on they met and how the, how nicholson and this silver cup was given to him this is a, a indication that there is a connection at that level because at the level of existence we are all one you know it not but master knows it as a master i know who i am connected with and who will come when so until tomorrow wait take care